Hey team, welcome back. Today I've put together a brief tutorial that will help guide you through the process of linking your Google Analytics account with your Google Ads account. Now this process allows us to have a richer set of data that is generated from both Google Ads and Google Analytics. Essentially this allows us to have a better idea of how our ads are performing versus other traffic sources. Now, just quickly guys, before we get stuck in, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already, and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge, and tools to grow your small business online. And with that happy note, let's go ahead and jump into our Google Analytics dashboard. <music> Okay guys, so here we are on our Google Analytics dashboard, and this is for the account that we want to connect to our Google Ads account. So this is one of our clients, and we manage their ads for them. So what we wanna do now is actually connect their Google Analytics with their Google Ads account. Now to do that on our Google Analytics dashboard, what we first wanna do is come down to admin. Now guys, if you're not too familiar with Google Analytics, what I'll do is add a tutorial up above which will guide you through how you can get started with Google Analytics. And what this tutorial will do, will just give you an overview of how Google Analytics works and help you make the most of Google Analytics. Okay, so what we wanna do now under our Google Analytics admin is navigate up to property. Now make sure your account is selected for the business that you want to connect to Google Ads and then make sure that your property is selected for that business. Then come down to property user management and here we just want to check that we have the right permission for us to be able to connect Google Analytics with Google Ads. Now as you can see we do have permission. You want to make sure that you can edit. You have the option to edit this account. So what we're going to do now is exit out of that one and now what we want to do is actually navigate over to Google Ads and make sure that our account is set up and ready to be linked. Okay, so here we are on our client's Google Ads account, the account that we want to connect with Google Analytics. Now, the first thing we wanna do is make sure that our email is up above here. Now, you wanna make sure this email is the same email that has the edit permission within our Google Analytics account, as I just showed you. Then within the Google Ads account, what we want to do is navigate up to Tools and Settings and then come down to Access and Security. Now here under Users, you want to make sure that your email address is down here and it has admin level access. Now if you can't see your email address in here, the same one that we have in our Google Analytics account, then what you want to do is go ahead and add that email. Now for us, because we're using a Manager's account, what we want to do is navigate over to Managers, and as you can see, we have our Managers account here. And that looks all good for us, so now we should be able to connect our Google Ads with our Google Analytics. So what we need to do is actually do this through our Google Analytics account. Now before we do that, just head back to Users. For the majority of you, like I mentioned, you want to make sure that you have your email address down here, and you have admin level access. And if you don't have admin level access on your Google Ads account or this Google Ads account that you're trying to connect and you can't give yourself admin access, then try and get in contact with the owner of this Google Ads account and ask them to give you that admin level access. So we're all connected now. What we're going to do is actually head over to our Google Analytics account. And as you can see, this is where we left off in our Google Analytics account. So we're under admin. Now what we want to do is come down to Google Ads linking. And here, all you need to do is select the Google Ad account that you want to connect with your Google Analytics. So what you want to do is make sure the ID is the same as your Google Ads account. So identify the Google Ads ID and then select that here. For us, remember we mentioned we linked our Google Ads Managers account. So we're going to come down under our Managers account and select the ID of the Google Ads we want to connect and then come down and click continue. Then here you just want to add the name of your business and then Google Ads just to identify if you have multiple accounts. And then come down to all website data and select on and then come down here under advanced settings and make sure that you have enabled auto tagging on all linked Google Ads accounts and this is recommended so keep that one selected and then come down and click link accounts. 
And as you can see guys, it's as simple as that. You can see that that has been a success. So congratulations, you've just connected Google Analytics with your Google Ads account. Now it may take up to 24 hours for your Google Ads link to begin displaying data. So give it 24 hours and then you should be able to see data on both Google Analytics and Google Ads. Here you can learn about other ways that you can make the most of this link between Google Analytics and Google Ads. So see analytics, engagement metrics in Google Ads, import goals and e-commerce transactions into Google Ads, and you can create remarketing audiences in analytics. So now that your Google Ads and Google Analytics are connected, you're gonna start having and start seeing more rich data from both accounts. So guys, just like that, you can see that this is a brief but important process and then just come down and click done and there we have it guys that is it for today's brief tutorial i hope you managed to link your google analytics and google ads accounts together now if you have any questions about this tutorial make sure to pop them down below and with that said thank you so much for watching this tutorial all the way through to the end if you got value don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already and that way i'll see you in the next video take care guys